All right, there's a combo right there. It's gonna be in the description. For those that need a tutorial, here we go. All right, crouching medium attack into standing medium attack. All right. Remember, if I'm going too fast, you can always pause the video, rewind. All right, after the medium attack, you're gonna do up forward, light medium. All right. After that last medium, you're going to do down heavy kick into super dash. Alright, super dash being the R2 button on the PS4. That shouldn't be too hard so far. After the super dash, you're going to do light attack, medium attack, down heavy attack again. Now after that last down medium attack, this is probably the hardest part of the combo, you're gonna immediately jump up forward light light punch. Okay? Or sorry, light attack. So as soon as that last down heavy attack hits, you're gonna do up forward light attack. You're gonna do light attack into medium attack. Alright. And the key is to do it as soon as the down heavy attack lands. Alright. Actually, what, what you could also do instead of doing light into medium, just do the light light auto combo version. It's just easier to execute. So that makes sense. After that. Down heavy attack, you do up forward, light, light. Light, light quickly, and you'll get the light attack and medium attack to come out. Alright, after that last uh, medium attack of the light, light string, you're gonna do quarter circle back, medium attack, which is his little um, like uppercut move. Alright, so let's go ahead and do that. Alright. Now as soon as Vegeta lands, you're just going to do Core Circle Forward R1. Or Dragon Rush, whatever it's on your controller. Core Circle Forward, Super, and then... Yeah, that's a combo. You could also do Core Circle Back. To do the level 3 version as soon as you land on the ground. And that's all it is. Uh, so let's do it one more time with the Super. Alright, hope you guys enjoyed, hopefully it helped you out, thanks for watching, peace out guys.